So in today's video we are going to install Pentest GPT on Kali machine. First we are going to clone the repository on our Kali machine and then we are going to follow the installation instructions as given on the repository. It is fairly simple process. Let's clone. In the meantime, I'll go ahead and show you the Python version. Uh, if anyone has ambiguity that which Python version should be realized. The base Python version as you can see is 2.7 but uh, the Pentest GPT is going to be compatible with Python 3. The Python 3 version in my system is 3.8. So we will be using Python 3.8 to execute the scripts that are provided in this repository. Uh, let's see where are we with the cloning procedure. Um, Once cloned, we are going to move ahead and install the requirements. We are going to execute pip install and there is the requirement txt file given in the repository. So we'll go into the repository and we'll install the requirements that are given in the requirement.txt file. Let's wait for the requirements to be installed and then we will go ahead and configure the required configuration settings. Now, next step, we need to rename the configuration sample configuration file they have provided. Oops. We are going to copy the command. Um, can rename the file but I prefer uh, to save the original configuration we are going to nano if you prefer Vim you can use that what we have to do is to find the configuration uh, file edit it and change the cookie and user agent you can also use the key uh, but right now we are going to go ahead and utilize cookies I'm going to show you how you need to log in into your chat GPT account and inspect element go to the networks tab and search for session this is the session authentication cookie and then you can refresh the page you'll see uh, the cookies uh, what we are looking for over here are the cookies in our request header um, you'll find two types of headers request headers and response headers um, but what we are looking for are specifically the cookies in request headers so we are going to go ahead and copy the cookies which are present in the request headers and paste them into the config file Similarly, now we need to look for the user agent. It is just beneath. We are going to copy it and place it into the configuration file. We have replaced the placeholder and now we are going to save it 
and exit out of the nano editor uh, next what we can do is uh, pentest gpt has given some commands to test the connection with the um, chat gpt portal and as you can see we are utilizing python 3 and the connection is successful so they have given uh, another command to actually run the main.py file and make a connection with the chat gpt api and now we are utilizing chat gpt model 4 and we have initialized our process we can find certain commands in the chat gpt uh, pentest gpt github repository we are going to use help to see some basic functionalities there are other commands that you can try and uh, this is the fairly simple installation process i'm going to show some usage in the next video don't forget to subscribe and uh, let's see now the results are gathering in and here is the output we can see that pentas gpt has given us a complete um, breakdown of the actual pentas procedure so this is it for the installation of pentas gpt on kali uh, we are going to explore more features next time uh, till then bye